guys, welcome to my iPhone X video. This is my home screen and this is a background of all my favorite people because I can't just choose one to be my background. And then we're gonna open up the first folder and it's my social media folder. And I have the basics like Twitter and Facebook and Instagram, my Facebook Messenger, my Snapchat, my YouTube, my Pinterest, Boomerang, and Photogrid, which Photogrid is where I edit some of my photos and make collages. And then we go back out and we have my calendar and my photo app. And in my photos, I have, you know, basic photos and selfies and what have you. And then we'll go back to the home screen and I have my camera and my game folder. And in my gaming folder, I have a lot of games for me and Ryder. First, we have my Magic Kingdoms game, which is my absolute favorite, next to Disney Blitz, and then Tsum Tsums, Dining Dash, Homescapes, Pokemon Go, Candy Crush, Bubble Witch 3, and Stack Jump. Then we flip over to the next page and it's Fire Up, Drop the Ball, Flappy Dunk, A Casino Game, Best Fiends, Delicious, Love Balls, A Picture Coloring Game, and Song Pop, which is my other new favorite game. And of course we have Choices, and the book that I'm reading on Choices is my Royal Romance, and I absolutely love it. And then I have my Group Me app, which I really only use for Ryder's T-Ball team. And then my next folder is my entertainment folder, and I have my Netflix, my Amazon Prime Video, DirecTV Now, and Hulu. And on Hulu, I'm obsessed with The Handmaid's Tale, and I cannot wait for season three to come out. And then I have my mail app, which this one's hooked up to my Yahoo account, which I don't get too much going into this one. Then we go back to the home screen, and you have my messages and my music, and we use Apple Music to get all our music between me and Scott. And if you go on our playlist, you could probably find anything for everyone we love country pop you know old classical music rock music r&b you name it it's probably on our list because we just love all kinds of music all kind of music including boy bands then we go back to the home screen and next to my music is my phone button and that's all my favorites all my little family members and then you know the clock which we don't pay attention to then we have on the next page, it's not as neat, the settings, calculator, you know, weather, internet, maps, all the Apple stuff. And then what the font, actually I got when I got my silhouette to use to download fonts on the computer, but now I can use it on YouTube. So, you know, that's a plus. And then Amazon, AMC, IMDB, Etsy, which I buy a lot of my silhouette stuff from, my food, cause I'm a food junkie, Redbox, Walmart, Walgreens, and then the deal finder is for dirt cheap because I love me some dirt cheap. And then the next folder over is on my health apps. You have the fitness app. My fitness pal is what I use to count my calories. The watch app is for my Apple watch. Glow and Ovia are lady apps that you can keep up with your periods and when you're fertile. Then you have another health app and then the activity one also goes with the watch. And then I have a walking app and a breathe app. And the Map My Walk app syncs up with my Fitness Pal app. So if I go on a walk, it'll bring all my activity into the app so I don't have to manually type it in. So I love that app, it's my favorite. <laughs> And then we go back to the home screen and the next folder over is just something that apps I don't really use. My FaceTime, my Yelp, Compass, Voice Memos, Find My iPhone, which I don't really use because on the Apple Watch it has a button to ping your phone. Contacts, Bitmoji, Zillow, and then my Regions account. And Zillow's kind of what we use when we like to fantasize about our future homes. And then, you know, Bitmoji, Snapchat, what up fam, you can add me, link down below. And then we flip over to the next page and it's the wallet, notes, grocery pickup for Walmart, another rental app, and then PayPal, which I like to use for Etsy things. And now we're going into my YouTube folder. And first on my YouTube folder, I have Fonto, which is what I use to make my thumbnails. Font is something that I use in case I wanna recreate an animated video or picture into my thumbnail or outro. My media is an app that I got for when I want to make a reaction video. I can put in the link in my media and it'll give me access to the video to put into my YouTube video. YouTube Studios is an app that I have to keep up with my subscribers and my comments and likes and how many views I have on a video. Thumbnail Maker and Intro Maker are kind of self-explanatory. I haven't used them yet, but I'll let you guys know how they are. 
eraser is something that I can erase the background of a picture. And then Filmmaker Pro and iMovie is how I edit my YouTube videos. And then we go back to the home page, and the last thing on my phone is my Gmail app. And this is what my YouTube email is set up to, but I don't have much mail today. Just build a bear, you know, the huge. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. See you later, guys. Bye. And I get everything underneath it first. Then I let it back down, and then I pin it back by section and straight.